Hi, everybody. Hope you're doing marvellously well. We've got something a little different for you. We're going to do a mic demo. We're going to bring back the wonderful Mikhail, who's going to sing and play acoustic guitar. She's going to be a singer-songwriter demo. But we're going to do this microphone here. This microphone's called New Twenties, and it's built by Tierra Audio. Now, Tierra Audio are a Spanish company, and they hand-make beautiful hardware. Look at this thing. It's a work of art. It's absolutely gorgeous. And yes, it does feel like a 20s microphone. I will tell you one thing. We really enjoyed working with this. And stay tuned. Listen to Mikhail singing and playing acoustic guitar on this. It's got a pop screen that fits on the front. As you can see, it easily clips on like that. It's magnetic. They also sent us this <laughs> rather lovely Produce Like a Pro banner to put on it which we did on the acoustic guitar only. It's not on the vocal, but it's a gorgeous looking mic. The question is, is it a gorgeous sounding mic? Let's check it out and see. Fill up my cup like you used to. Now you don't feel me up the same. Cause I have to I don't see it any other way But what if I stayed and was happy And my heart brought me back to Give my 
myself a little love Cause right now it's where I need to be Where I'm supposed to be So I hope you enjoyed the performance. I will say one thing before we get stuck in. Mikhail said it's her favourite vocal mic that she's tracked into. I loved it on vocals. I will say, with the exception of a KM56 or a KM53, this might be the acoustic guitar mic that we use more than anything else. Eric and I, he's nodding his head, really, really love the way this acoustic guitar sounds. Like, it is superb on her guitar. And it was amazing on the vocal as well. She loved it on the vocal. A couple of specs here. It's got a Lundahl transformer in it. She's probably got a big part of the sound. It is a uh, large diaphragm condenser, of course. It's in cardioid. Its impedance is 200 ohms for those that care about that stuff. Self-noise, minus 108 deep. Point is, it's not noisy. <laughs> uh, maximum SPO is 120 dB. That should That should pretty much... We could, we could put it in front of a kick drum if we want. I probably wouldn't put it slap bang in front of it. I'd put it back a few feet, but that's how I use all large diaphragms. There's nothing unusual about that. This could be, if I had a pair of these, I could probably record a full drum kit. One overhead, one in front. It has a little bit of a presence lift, so it would appear between about 3.5K and about 10K. Don't forget, you can enter to win. There is a link down there. They're very, very generously giving us one of these to give away. Okay, I'm going to listen to the acoustic in solo there is no eq there is no compression going on this this is the exact sound of the acoustic to me to me it sounds like neil young after the gold rush do you know what i mean we should have done a cover of after gold rush but we did a song called right now which is beautiful, and it was written by Mikhail. She came in and she said, is it okay if I do an original? So this is an original. It's really gorgeous. But doesn't that sound like Neil Young? You can just... Every time it hits, there's a little extra warmth of her fingers, the way she plays, and it kind of just pushes forward beautifully. There's so much depth and dimension in this acoustic guitar sound. The only time I've heard it this good is with my Neumann KM56, which is worth, you know, a, a small car. And this is a thousand dollar microphone. Superb. Now, if you listen to the vocal, I can listen to it with and without the reverb. Here's the reverb that you heard on it. Feel a marker like you used. Let's mute the reverbs. We'll go back, keep listening. Now you don't feel me up the same. It's warm. It's got low end in it. Pull myself out cause I have But it's a little crisp bite to it. I don't see it any other way. It's smooth. And that is a take, by the way. It's not a comp, it's a take. She sang a full take, and this is the one we chose. But what if I stayed in no tuning. Was happy? Put the guitar in. And my heart brought me back to you. Put the reverb in. Something inside needed breaking. Now, depending on the singing, you might want to put a little bit more DSing in there. Maybe you want to brighten it a bit after DSing it. I don't know. I think it sounds fantastic. It's interesting because they specifically said to us, can you try out this microphone and would you mind trying it on a singer-songwriter? Because normally we do a full band. And I love doing that because I love hearing what the mic would do on drums. I like hearing what it would do on guitars and basses. And then when you download the multitracks, you can decide for yourself and you can hear it and think, oh, especially because we have such a wealth of multitracks. We've, we've, I don't know how many mic demos we've done now, maybe 30, 40, 40. 
I feel way more than way that. more than that. And every time we do a mic demo or a piece of gear, you can download the multi tracks. And often we work with the same artist, like Mikhail. We've worked with multiple times. Um, Steve Majora, of course, we've worked with multiple times. Um, Kelly Ferrara. These are artists that we work with continuously, both on their own music. We know them intimately. You know, you can compare and contrast, and uh, you know, and get a really good feel for what we're doing and for what the mic can do. There's a lot of mics I like. There's been a lot of barriers kicked down. There's been a lot of wonderful, wonderful river mics coming out, obviously, in the last 20 years. Royer, the 121, is a great microphone. Lewitt started bringing out microphones that are, like, really transparent, very, very accurate, you know, that can take EQ and compression, and more importantly, you can color there. This, for me, is a studio mic. I know it sounds like a stupid thing to say, but one that has a very, very unique look and a very unique sound. I don't know if I would call it transparent. There's a little bit of like low, mid thickness in there, but not excessive. That gives the acoustic guitar body. Again, listening to the acoustic guitar. Just adds body, but no boominess. And in her vocal... I mean, she's got a very rich voice. Mikhail has got an incredibly rich voice. But listen to the vocal here. I don't see it any other way. Many other... There's body in there. It's nice. It's nice. It's not a very colored mic. It's a slightly colored mic. It's got a little bit of a boutique-y feel without being a million dollars, without being $10,000, without being $5,000. It is a $1,000, but I don't know. It's pretty striking. And we do like the Tiara Audio guys and girls. They're a wonderful, wonderful company to work with. Spanish, handmade, made in Spain by them. They've been telling us about this mic for about two years. And finally, 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 I'm late to the party. I'm finally trying it out. And I've got to be honest, I'm very impressed. And I think for Mikhail, I promised her I would tell you guys and girls this. This is her favorite mic that we've tested on her vocals. She just kept saying it. I didn't ask, what do you think? She's like, oh, this sounds amazing. Because I had to give it up. Don't know what you have till you lose everything. I knew that I had to leave. Download the files. Decide for yourself. And of course, enter to win. I'm really impressed with this. I love that this is a company, a small company that's mainly known for building audio hardware. And this is, I presume, their first one of their first ventures into microphones. If you've got a, like a studio and you've got some handful of boutique pieces of equipment and you've got the usual suspects and you've got some modern microphones to do and you want something unique that a singer's going to come in and first of all, love the sound of, but secondly, also love the look of, this might be a microphone for you. Because... You know, I just reviewed something last week that we loved that was $1,500 that kind of killed 87s. It felt like an 87, but didn't cost two and a half times as much. This, I think, at $1,000 fulfills a microphone that's very boutique and specialist. And if you're that kind of geeky guy and girl, like I am that kind of geeky enough and you want that sort of thing, I think this might be the mic for you. I really do. We'll try it out on other things as well, guaranteeing that we're going to use this for acoustic guitars from now on. Really, really super impressed. Acoustic guitars, and we'll try it out with different singers and see who it suits, but it definitely suits Mikhail's very rich voice. Let's keep listening. Because I had to give it up to know what you have till you lose everything. I knew that I had to leave you all that world, but all that I don't need. Coming up slowly, can I take a break from this mess I made? Give myself. So please download the multi tracks. Add some of your own production. I'd love to hear what you do. For all of you Academy members out there, this would be a really great one to add some production to. Maybe next month we can do a reviews of your production added to this track. So Academy members, please do that. If you're not already a member of the Academy, there will be a link down below where you can join. Also, of course, a link to win this beautiful mic. Tierra Audio, great guys and girls, wonderful product. Well, thanks for doing this. That was very fun. I really, really appreciate it. Very impressed. 
not only with the look and feel of this, but of course the sound. And I guarantee it will be used a lot for a lot of vocals. And I guarantee 100% of the time, this is our new acoustic guitar microphone. Wonderful, wonderful product. Simple, easy to use. I'm not using this complimentary. There's been a couple of mics recently, actually, a newer product by Lewitt that we all loved. I think it's universally, of course, the 1040 and recently, of course, the Loughton Audio one. This is not those microphones. It's not the multi-patterned, padded, um, versatile, does a million jobs, 55 different sounds, kind of all-in-one incredible mic that we're, we're starting to enjoy. This is a very specific, very single sound that is really good, is really, really good. If this was invented 30 years ago, it would be in everybody's mic locker because it would be one of those mics that every big studio had for, oh yeah, I love that on the acoustic. I love that on like girl vocals. I love it on this. I love it on that. That's one of these kind of microphones. Do you understand what I mean? It's a beautiful mic. Congratulations, Tierra Audio. I love that you've done this. And thanks ever so much for sharing one with us and letting us give a microphone away. So down below, enter to win one of these. Enjoy yourselves. Download the multi-tracks. Do some production. I want to hear what you can do. So long, farewell, la vida, say, and au revoir. Adios, adios, ciao, goodbye.